What if I fall in love with you? I have been a fan of J.D. Souther's music for a long time now. I was quite affected by the fact that Mr. Souther hadn't toured at all since the release of his 1984 album, Home by Dawn, for I myself wasn't born until 1985. My hopes of seeing J.D. in concert seemed faithless. When I heard in 2008 that J.D. was releasing his first studio effort in 24 years, I was very excited. When I read on his website that he was launching a tour for his new album, If the World Was You, I felt some good fortune had shined down on me. When local dates were announced in October of 2008, I immediately called the local venue and reserved my ticket. However, this particular West LA venue had no online printout tickets, nor email confirmation of any sorts. They charged my card over the phone and it was will call only. Flash forward to the week of the show in December. I was excited all week to see JD. Thursday night, I go online to review details of the concert, showtime, address of the venue, etc. When I see that the show was on Tuesday, I had missed the show completely. I was definitely standing in the hall of broken dreams. Here I had waited literally my entire life to see JD Souther in person, and I missed my chance. I honestly thought that he would never tour again. I considered this one of the most foolish mistakes of my musical life. After this immense disappointment, I frequented JD's website hoping to hear news of additional tour dates. In May of 2009, my luck took a turn for the better. JD was adding a new leg to his tour and would be back in my area next month. The trip to Orange County was well worth it. I was overwhelmed with feelings of gratitude and contentment as I watched JD perform his emotive compositions. He played all of his songs so beautifully and the entire crowd was charmed with his sense of humor, down-to-earth attitude, and sincerity. I even had the chance to meet JD after his set. Just as JD has the power to portray the highs and lows of life and love with his music, I've endured highs and lows of equal proportions in my own quest to see JD perform in person. JD and his music mean the world to me, and I would like to commend him for the well-deserved ASCAP Golden Note Award. Congratulations, JD! My God loves you so If you didn't want me to tell